This weekend, uh, Afghanistan revisited uh, art and culture exhibit. Uh, was organized in Northrop King Building in North uh, East. It's going to be on uh, Friday and Saturday and Sunday. And uh, this uh, organized by uh, Amina Baha. And we went there to talk to her about uh, uh, her idea behind uh, uh, that art uh, exhibit. Hi, my name is Amina Baha, and today we're here at an exhibition titled Afghanistan Revisited. Uh, the purpose of this exhibition is to let our Minnesota uh, community know more about Afghanistan, especially a side of Afghanistan that they um, that the mass media does not cover. And um, I wanted people to just come and immerse themselves into what it would feel like to go walk into an Afghan home or um, perhaps cafe. These are kind of the artifacts and things that are going there. You've been working on this for a long time and you made some decisions to bring certain arts that really reflects yes. the other Afghanistan. Um, yes, so I've been thinking about this for two years, but all this work has taken me a year to put together. Um, and recently my mother was just in Afghanistan, so I gave her like a huge list of things to bring me back, and this is the, the, the outcome. So what's the logistic of it, bringing all this from Afghanistan, contacting artists, Thanks to Facebook, I was able to connect with almost all my uh, my photographer. Um, I have his picture on the back wall. He is the one that took all these pictures and sent them to me in high res resolution. And I printed them and framed them. Um, but as far as all the other artifacts are concerned, my mom brought them. What's Afghanistan to you? Uh, well, I don't know much about Afghanistan right now because like, I didn't went there until now it's little. Mm -hmm. Like in here, like it's so cold and stuff, but in Afghanistan, they're like, in the winter, it's like like how summer is here. And uh, yeah, in summer, it's so, so hot that people... Like, people are sweaty. Yeah. What's your name? You look very cool. Oh, that's the Afghanist flag, huh? Mm -hmm. Remember it? Yes. I, uh, you look like you should be a musician of some sort. Actually, no. We can music uh, devices. Mm -hmm. So it calls rubab, and this one called harmonia, and this one called tabla. And this is a really good one, you know what I mean? Like, and this is called chamba. Yeah. Chamba is These are hands. Mm -hmm. So this one is. This, this head is for like, this is a turban. When you turn up, put this one on the head, and then you turn on the turban, this is a turban. Our Mujahideen, like, holy fighters, yeah. they did jihad against Russia. Uh -huh. So they were used to wear this turban. This, uh, <laughs> much they don't need helmet once they use yeah, this. <laughs> no, they don't care. Like, yeah. This, uh, whatever you see, it is uh, the support of uh, the local community members and uh, especially our sister Amina Baha, that she put this exhibition on the way. It's the first time ever in Minnesota. In the future, we're... What is the most uh, things uh, uh, misunderstood about Afghanistan in America? I think this is a very huge question. I'm not a politician. <laughs> I know. Afghanistan and the United States of America since 1935. Mm. And you see these pictures like that? This is the history from King Zahir Shah to now and how the Afghanistan was. And you see these medals. So this is showing your close connections. So I think America is leading to bring peace and stability in Afghanistan. Uh, this is, will be uh, very great for Americans that have never been in Afghanistan. And Americans, they've been hearing... Uh, yeah, so while I was setting up, a gal came in and she's like, oh my gosh, a burqa, can I try it on? That was the first thing she wanted to try on. And 
took a picture, so... Um, this is the burger. Yeah, the infamous so, burger. <laughs> Amin Abaha, the founder and organizer of Afghanistan Revisited Art and Culture Show, started this week in the northeast Minneapolis. It is uh, an invitation uh, to take another look at uh, Afghanistan. Go see it. It's a great show. Thank you and have a great evening. Thank you.